Hi Jurassic Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw Easter with Pusheen, so let's get started. To draw cute bunny Pusheen, let's first start by drawing a soft curve for the top of her head. So I'm just going to come right here, right in the center, and I'm going to go up for her ears. Round off the tip and come right back down. Same thing over here. Go up, come right back down. From there, I'm going to bring this down a little bit more. So I'm going to widen it out there. And before I finish that, let's come back to the top and we're going to draw in her stripes. So right here, I'm going to draw three stripes. And then we're going to come down right in the center, say about right here. Give myself a point and I'm going to draw a straight line down and curve out. So this is her mouth and nose area and curve out on both sides. Then right in the center, I'm just going to add a deeper curve for her mouth. Then let's come to the sides and we're going to draw her eyes. So about right here, I'm just going to go ahead and draw a circle. And I'll give it a little highlight right here and shade everything else in. So same thing on the other side. So about right here. And a highlight. There. So now that we have Pusheen's face in, we're going to go ahead and draw her body. So I'm going to bring this all the way down. And let's see here. I'm going to make Pusheen nice and plump, right? So I'm just going to start to bring it down. It's all up to you how tall you want to make her, but let's say about right there. And I'm going to round this part off and bring it in. and connect at the bottom. So it's a little bit softer curve towards the bottom and connect. Now that we have the basic shape for her body, let's go in and put in some details. So the first one would be her whisker. So let's come next to her eye about right here. I'm going to go ahead and draw two whiskers on both sides about right here. And then let's see here for her hands. We're going to have her holding an Easter egg, of course, right? So right underneath her eye, I'm going to come about right here and I'm just going to draw a curve for a hand and same thing under here. Under this eye, just going to draw a little curve for her hand. And then in between, we're going to draw an egg. So it's going to taper a little bit sharper towards the top, come down. And then the bottom is going to be much rounder for our egg. There. So she's holding a really big Easter egg that she found, right? <laughs> okay, so then from there, of course, let's draw her feet. So I'm going to come right here underneath her hand. So say about right here. I'm just going to go ahead and pop in a curve for her feet. And we'll do the same thing on the other side. So about right here, just pop in another feet, foot going the other way. And then for her tail, I'm going to come right here and just pop in this tail towards the bottom. So say about right here, it's going to curve out, round it off and bring it right back in. And then we need to draw her stripe. So one, two, and then three right there there okay so then now to make her a bunny and ready for easter let's give her some bunny ears so i'll just find my center right here and i'm going to go up for some really cute bunny ears round it off and bring it right back in so same thing on the other side round it off and bring it right back in then we're just going to go ahead and draw the center just follow your outside and same thing here. Nice and simple, right? And then let's see here. I'm going to add a heart to decorate this Easter egg, of course. Right there. And maybe a stripe. Just so we can tell that this egg has some dimension there. Volume, right? Okay, so we're pretty much done with Pusheen and she's ready for uh, Easter, but I thought it would be really cute to uh, give her an Easter basket as well. So if you want to do that, let's come about right here. 
And I'm just going to draw a soft curve across. So this is the top of our basket. And I'm going to come right here, just give it a little curve. And I'm going to basically draw another curve here. But before I do that, I'm going to come to, say, about the center area, about right here. And I'm going to draw a circle, the center of our bow. So I'm just going to make this really big bow right here for our basket. So if you're using a pencil, definitely just finish this curve before you draw the bow. Let's draw this some details right here. And then we're going to come down for a little tail for our bow. And now that we're done with our bow, let's go ahead and thicken this top part of our basket up. So whatever space you have. So just creating that little rim. I think my camera, this is a little bit too high there. <laughs> okay, so then I'm gonna bring down this basket to, it doesn't really matter. I'll just say I'll bring it up to about right here. Definitely lower than my bow, of course. So I'll just go ahead and connect it at the bottom. There. Okay, so then now that I have that in, let's go ahead and draw the handle. So I'm going to come right back here and I'm going to thicken this handle. So I'll draw the inside part first. Just go up nice and high, bring it over and thicken it up. So just follow your bottom and bring it right back there. And of course we need to add some Easter eggs in here. So let's come to the center. I'm going to add one big egg right here and two more on the sides. And let's see, let's add some on the back. There. And you, it's all up to you how you want to decorate your eggs, of course, but I'll just... Uh, I'll just simplify it and add some curves right here. Maybe some big polka dot ones, some zigzag ones. And let's see, let's add some stripes as well on our basket just to decorate it. So I really hope this drawing inspires you to come up with your own pushing Easter drawing. And now that we have that in, let's go ahead and I'm just going to draw some grass right here so we know we're outside and we're going to add some dandelions, of course, right here. And now that we're done with our dandelions, I thought it'd be really cute. Just add a little butterfly right here if you want. So I'm just going to draw a little angle line. And I'm just going to draw these two curves. We're a very simple pushing butterfly there. And that is it for this cute pushing celebrating Easter. I really hope I made this fun and easy for you to follow along with me. And thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe, of course, so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.